self-preservation. You condemned an entire world so that you alone might escape death alone. Him alone. Life. I think I understand. He... My grasp that grew weaker. It was theirs that grew stronger. Ultima's vessel. I don't care. Just hold on. Listen to me, Clive. Do you remember the murals? People once knew that Ultima was their god. That he created them. And they worshipped him, prayed to him, looked to him for guidance. 
in vain. For he did not listen, did not acknowledge our will, and so we strayed from his path to forge one of our own. So absorbed was he in his own desires, so driven by his own will alone, that he shunned the one thing that could have made him truly powerful. Faith. The same faith people now place in you. Faith that you will fulfill their dream, Sid's dream, of creating a better world for us. Faith that you will follow in Father's footsteps and save those who need saving most. Faith that you will answer Jill's plea to save yourself. The difference is, Clive, that you chose to listen, and that is what has steeled our bonds. Bonds that helped you stand firm when Ultima's pole was at its strongest. His power may be absolute, but so is ours, and so will yours be. With my light in your heart, not even a god might stop us. Joshua! Do it, you Enough, Clive. My body is too far gone. If the wound does not take me, the curse will. the vessel. 